when I was six. T5, I had really big trouble in the back room. All I had for breakfast was a huge hamburger, but not long after, I ran and ran and I'd sit down on my toilet to take a dump. And I sit there waiting for the poop to come out, but it was absolutely stuck in my anus. Anyway, after a few hours of this, I said, this is a big waste of my time. And I get the toilet plunger. I stand up and stick it onto my butt. And I start pumping away like mad. And I try and I try to get that crap out. Ah, 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 ah. It's hurting. But I'm not taking no for an answer. <coughs> then I noticed the plunger was stuck to my bump. <coughs> Great. So now I get the Michael Rosen lube. Oh, it was lovely. Anyway, I took the lube and I rubbed it on my ass and the plunger popped right off me. Wonderful. And then I noticed there was a great big chunk of poop stuck to the plunger. I smell it. Mmm, nice. Anyway, I think I'll get toilet paper. I try to get the huge sloppy poop off the plunger, but it was sticky and my fingers went right through the toilet paper. So now I've got the Michael Rosen shite all over my knuckles. Meanwhile, my mum is at the bathroom door. My mum calls out, Hello, is everything good? I said, oh, uh, yeah, great. Everything's fantastic. Then she asked, do you want an apple? Mum, why the fuck would I want an apple? Will you go away? Okay, Michael, okay. So I try to wash off the plunger in the sink. Shh. But my do-do was too sticky and it clogged the sink. I was an idiot. Meanwhile, I've got little dribbles of poop coming out my butt all over the floor. So I start sliding on the shitey floor. Slap! Kapoom! Ow! I lay there on the floor with soggy lumps of dirt all over my hair and face. Oh no, this is horrible! Perhaps, I thought, when I got up this morning, I won't have to put my face in the chunk of shit. But no! Why should I get a break? Anyway, I start taking off all my clothes and I get in the shower and I'm just washing up. Then, suddenly, Mum says, Right, Michael, that's enough. I'm coming in. Oh, no! Now, I was really fucked. She opens the door and then that really does it. Would you believe it, Michael? I don't believe it. I really don't. Do we take a dirty shit in the sink and fiddle diddle with the toilet plunger at 9.30? No, no, no we, we don't. don't. No, no, we, we don't. don't. And why is your poop everywhere but the toilet? Ah, Mum, just wait a sec. I can explain. I was not fiddle diddling anything. Mum says, you can't fool me. Why do you have lube? Shit. I never felt quite so horrible in all my life. So that was that. I never saw Mum again, 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 again. Hmm. Later that day, my poop turned into chocolate cake. Wonderful. So I ate the lot. And I had loads to eat. <laughs> the Michael Rosen fart tea time. At school, my friend Hans let one rip. And it was horrible. It smelled awful. Like hundreds of rats died. Our teacher starts yelling at us. No farting. And so she started looking all around the class trying to figure out who farted. No one knew but me. I put my face behind my face. I robbed my dick. I robbed my dick. I robbed my dick. Not long after, it was very hard. <laughs>